child. I am granting you profound blessings and potent promises. I am enriching your finances, ensuring prosperity that will liberate you from all debts. I will elevate you so highly that even those who envy you will find you unrecognizable. Within my teachings, you'll find invaluable advice to enhance your wisdom and expand your understanding, enabling you to make judicious choices and sidestep the snares set by adversaries. Always remember, I am more than a guardian. I am your friend, and my deepest wish is for you to place your trust in me above all others. I empower you with formidable strength and sharpen your perception to recognize the deceit of those who plot against you in secrecy. No harmful hand will reach you. In my care you are safeguarded. My angels encircle you, defending you against any danger. I foil the schemes of the malicious and those intent on pulling you down. That's why your foes grow furious. Their strategies crumble each time they attempt to strike. Do not fear them, for I will methodically dismantle their efforts. Continue your journey in peace, confident in my constant presence. You need not worry, for I am your protector and caregiver. Your children are secure within my grasp, immune to the adversary's plots, which I have already thwarted. I vigilantly guide every step your children take, ensuring they never falter and remain safely in my embrace. Persist in your prayers and kneel daily to fortify your faith, witnessing my mighty hand deliver solutions and transformative changes to your concerns. Live knowing that all will be well and stride confidently toward the splendid future you envision. Proceed with joy and a smile, spreading my teachings, my illumination, and my love. This will perplex your adversaries and drive those who wish you harm to abandon their schemes and seek your forgiveness. You are my chosen one, and I refuse to let you face defeat. They may attempt to challenge you, but you will see them ultimately face their disgrace. Release all negativity and let your words be filled with faith and hope. Do not be disheartened by lies, slander, insults, or false reports. You have the potential to reach far beyond your current limitations, to a place I have destined for you. However, your progress may stall if you give credence to those who wish to lead you into darkness. My plan is for you to be blessed and for my perfect design to be realized in your life. Take this seriously. The time is now. By holding my hand, you can achieve all your dreams. But if you let go and stray, you risk defeat. Remember, apart from me, you can accomplish nothing. I desire to see you always victorious. You will not encounter shame or defeat, but you must stay within my shelter and protection. Many will try to divert your attention, but my spirit will protect your heart from discouragement, confusion, or depression. If you ever feel disheartened, take a moment to be alone and come talk with me. I'm fully aware of your circumstances, but I want you to express your emotions, to unload those burdens from your soul and leave them at my altar. I will transform your mourning into joy, your discouragement into delight, and endow you with strength. I will eradicate any weakness within you. We will combat these challenges together. You are never alone in this fight. Advance fearlessly, even through dark and uncertain paths, you are courageous, and nothing can intimidate you. I take joy in seeing your bravery and victorious spirit. Every victory we share is not only a testament to my faithfulness and love, but also a reflection of your sincere devotion to me. I have many precious gifts waiting for you. Because you have been faithful in small matters, a greater abundance is forthcoming. Offer me your worship and praise. I seek to hold the preeminent place in your life. I am ready to reveal to you marvelous things beyond your imagination. 
acknowledging the seriousness with which you pursue our relationship. From this day forward, you are stepping into a new realm of supernatural abundance, where blessings and opportunities will unfold like never before. Banish fear from your heart and mind. I am here to guide you to success. If you trust in me, you will overcome. I ask you now, do you believe in my promises? When you answer, I believe with all my heart. Listen closely, for I have something crucial to share. With love I speak to you, and with an embrace of love I soothe you. It is my will for you to experience profound peace, to internalize deeply the words I send to your soul. The era of suffering has ended. The time of sadness and brokenness has passed. In my powerful name, you will conquer the affliction that has plagued you. Life and healing are on their way to you. Courage and joy are infusing your being. Strength and bravery arrive with each new dawn, filling any void with boundless joy. I command you now to get accustomed to happiness and to relish the blessings I have already bestowed upon you. Listen closely to me. Do not turn away or cease to hear my voice. Do not dismiss or overlook these words meant for your benefit. I love you ceaselessly, and I am eager to provide you with abundant affection and holy comfort, so that amid trials you feel protected, supported, blessed, and profoundly loved. However, because I hold you dear in my heart, there is something vital I must share for the healing of your inner being. Accept and cherish these words I impart. If you wish for the doors and windows of heaven to open, if you long to cross the bridge to the divine and supernatural, you must purge all grievances and negativity from your heart. While I rejoice in your faith, do not let the venom of complaint diminish your earnest belief. Avoid nurturing negative emotions or thoughts of pessimism, as they can proliferate unexpectedly, threatening the vitality of your precious faith. Remove criticism from your discourse. Distance yourself from friends who foster discord, doubt, and resentment. Instead, seek the company of wise and supportive companions. Decide today whether you will embrace the positive transformations and blessings that are soon to manifest in your life. If you abandon complaints, if you cling to faith, if you embrace hope, and if you reject all negativity, wondrous outcomes will follow. Blessings, provision, freedom, healing, family harmony, joy in your soul, and a heart brimming with happiness. All these gifts flow abundantly to a heart that chooses to believe in me. I'm here to clear the obstacles that block your path, to tear down the walls that obscure your view of the splendid future awaiting you. I'm severing the harsh ties that bind your hands and lifting the immense burden that threatens to sink your spirit. For too long, adverse winds have steered you towards the storm's eye, threatening to drown you in sadness and despair. But today, I proclaim your liberation. I will breathe my divine breath upon this tempest of malice. The clouds laden with fear and anxiety will dissipate. The words I speak to you carry life. They hold the power to manifest real miracles, the changes you've yearned for, and the fresh start you've prayed for. However, heed this warning. You are no longer at a stage where time can be squandered. You cannot afford to rise from this moment and forget my words. Do not trivialize the grace and mercy bestowed upon you. Nourish your soul with my word. Let it heal you. Sweeten your heart with the honey of heaven. Embrace the counsel you receive today. This year, put into practice all the edifying lessons you've absorbed. I will remind you each morning as you awaken. You will gaze upon me, your spiritual ear attuned to my voice. And if my presence seems elusive, seek me out. You know where I am, as near as your faith, within reach of your prayers. I am eager to fulfill the desires that spring from your heart. 
If you wish to witness supernatural miracles, know the steps. Entrust me with your heart. Cast aside doubts. Act justly. Hand over the reins of your life. And pay heed to my words. I have foretold significant transformations soon to unfold, and the promises I have made to you will come to fruition. You will be released from debt. I will provide you with work and strength. Nothing is impossible for me. And throughout this time you've spent getting to know me, you have gradually begun to perceive, understand, and believe that my word is true. It must and will be fulfilled. I love you deeply. Cling tightly to me. Surrender your doubts and grievances. Stop fighting with your own strength. Allow me the chance to bless you and show you the immense love I have for you. My presence will forever accompany you. My Holy Spirit will fill and guide you. Declare your belief in me. Hand over your sorrow, your frustrations. Place in my hands the dreams you felt compelled to abandon. Lay down at my feet those thoughts that undermine your worth. Together, we will navigate this journey, and you will see the fullness of my blessings and love unfold in your life. I desire for you to experience true love, a love that is genuine and unlike any you have felt before. This is the beautiful, tender, and powerful love I offer you. Continue to pray. I want you close, sheltered safely under my holy protection. The discouragement you face seeks to pull you away, to tear you from my embrace and drag you through a perilous desert. But this is not the fate I have planned for you. Today I am reaching out to lift your spirits, grant you peace, relieve your anxiety, and endow you with the strength you need. Do you accept my love? Will you embrace the strength I provide? Respond with the full sincerity of your heart. Promise that you won't leave my presence. But know this, even if you try to leave, even if adversaries attempt to snatch you away, I will never let you stray. Wherever you go, I will be there, ready to bring you back to me. The adversary might whisper that you are destined to be alone, that I have forsaken you because you are imperfect. But that is not true. I will never leave you or abandon you. Nothing can sever you from my love. Not shame, rejection, failure, nor condemnation. I love you with an everlasting love that cannot be broken. You are aware of this, but I reaffirm it now, declaring it anew. I am igniting within your heart the flame of my eternal love. You can feel it stirring in your spirit. I am inspiring you to live passionately, regardless of the seemingly insurmountable challenges, the formidable obstacles, and the attacks you currently endure. From this day forward, everything will change. You will not be the same. Today marks your rebirth. Today you begin to inherit what I have promised you. Eternal life awaits in my presence, but my Holy Spirit is also with you now, empowering you with the strength needed in this world. When you feel this fire touching your soul, your lips will open in praise, and you will finally comprehend the magnitude of my power. I will lift you to great heights, and you will feel as if you are dreaming. Your lips will overflow with joyful song. The burdens that have weighed you down will dissolve, you will see yourself as I see you, special and destined to rise above your challenges and embrace new blessings. You are not part of the group that shies away from my word, the ones who wake up only to see darkness and lies, choosing to feel abandoned. They reject my love and affection, striving for perfection in the mistaken belief that it's the only path to my grace. My only request is for a simple and sincere faith. If such people attempt to diminish your happiness, do not welcome them, reject their offerings, and do not plead for their friendship. Surround yourself with those who uplift and value you, who do not seek to dominate your life or meddle in your family's choices. Do not let adversaries bring you back under the yoke of defeat and disparagement. 
Instead, choose the company of those who respect you, who refrain from meddling and spreading rumors. Bless those who genuinely encourage you without expecting anything in return. Your faith journey is a personal one between you and me. I am eager to speak with you, to reveal and discuss my plans. If you seek a deeper connection, come. Find me in the quiet of the morning. Dedicate time to me when others are asleep. Bring your petitions and listen attentively to the guidance I provide daily. Have faith, and I will respond in various ways, revealing myself to you and your family. Call on me, and I will show you great and hidden things in dreams and visions, making my intentions known. I am elevating you to witness supernatural miracles. Embrace and share these words with faith, and abundant blessings will envelop you. No matter how challenging your situation may be, never lose sight of my greatness and power. Seek refuge under my protection if you're distressed. Lean on my shoulder and pour out your concerns if you're anxious. Entrust me with your fears and anxieties. My grace and mercy are boundless, and my love for you is profound. I will aid you. You are my child, beyond any doubt. You have opened your heart to me. You love me fervently, and this brings me joy. Therefore, you have every right to approach me confidently and speak openly. Communicate with me without fear. Do not think that I am monitoring your actions to punish you. I placed you in this world and chose you before your birth. I know your struggles and strengths, your dreams and weaknesses. I do not hold grudges when you falter, nor should you hide from me out of guilt. To whom else would you turn? To someone who claims to care and love you, but ultimately betrays you? Trust in me, for I am ever faithful and loving, and I will never betray you. Here in my presence, I am not looking for your faults, for I already know them. Nor am I waiting for you to fail, so I can turn away from you. Instead, when you try to distance yourself, my spirit actively seeks you out. When you turn away from my love, I come to you and guide you back to the river of tranquility, where you can drink from the living, strengthening waters that you cherish. This is why I urge you, even in your darkest moments, never forget that I love you deeply. My affection and power are ever-present, ready to lift you from despair, to imbue your soul with purpose and fulfillment and to restore the hope and encouragement you may have lost. I want you to truly believe and feel deeply loved and protected, for this has always been true, is true now, and will be true for all eternity. Raise your arms in victory, even if you feel discouraged, even if you don't feel like fighting, or if you think your adversaries have prevailed. Regardless of how you feel, follow my command. Raise your arms now, and remember that you are victorious through faith, a child of the Most High God, who loves you immensely, who drapes you in grace and surrounds you with favor. Recall, too, the victories of your past. You have faced and overcome enemies that seemed invincible. You have fought with all your might and won. You know what it is to battle, to grow weary, to fall to come into my presence to receive new strength and to rise and triumph once again. You have savored victory and now, more than ever, you are equipped to face all your conflicts. Today, you wield the sword of my Holy Spirit and carry within you the holy word I have planted in your heart. You have never been a coward. Allow me to touch your heart and dispel the discouragement that clouds your vision. A flame is kindling within your soul, urging you to continue fighting for your dreams and for the loved ones by your side. Know that you are not alone. You are cherished and valuable. Lean on my shoulder and cast away those painful thoughts that suggest you are unloved or that I have forsaken you, for you know this is not the truth. Embrace my words and feel my warm, 
comforting embrace at this moment. You will not falter or be overwhelmed by conflicts or suffering. No matter what comes, trust in me, have faith, hand over your pain, and let me provide comfort. If you need to cry, I am here to listen. Open your heart now and share what you are feeling. Surrender those lingering feelings of failure and defeat. I will be by your side every morning, every afternoon, every night, offering comfort and support, affirming how much I value you. My love envelops you, and my powerful hand will always protect you. Today you rise from victory to victory. You confront formidable enemies, leap over walls of conflict, and conquer the forces of evil by trusting in my word, which fortifies you with immense strength. At the end of your journey, come and on your knees, entrust your fears and weaknesses to me again. I am ready to heal you with my holy love, to mend all wounds inflicted by the world, and to help you raise your arms in victory. We will celebrate your triumphs together. I will crown you with a crown of life and strength and prepare you to continue your path the next day. When you feel you have reached the mountain summit, I will be there to celebrate with you and share in your joy. No matter where you are in life, my love for you is everlasting. I will always be ready to support you in everything you need. I have countless blessings for you and I will continuously find new ways to encourage you to keep fighting. Do not heed the complaints of the pessimistic. They have lost hope, seeing the world deteriorating. While the crowds run in fear, I keep you and your family sheltered under my mantle of love. I will surround you with abundance, provision, health, and protection. Do not fear material losses. The obstacles to your happiness are but temporary, and everything occurs for a reason. I lovingly care for those I love, and every challenge you encounter will be transformed into a blessing. I will remove those, aligned with evil, who attempt to undermine your future and disrupt my plans. They are deceived, believing they wield more power than your Heavenly Father, who adores you. Stand firm in your faith, unwavering. Ignore their criticisms and attacks. Focus and ready yourself to manage all the blessings I have in store for you. I am your true father. I love you, and each day as the sun rises, I am here to meet you. I am your omnipotent God. These words resonate within your heart. Feel my presence today. Bow your head in reverence, be still and wait. Close your eyes. Feel my affection touching your soul, moving your heart. Do not suppress your tears. Let them flow to wash away discouragement and despair. Rise, dust yourself off. Lift your hands to the heavens and proclaim with joy. Victory is mine. Remember the victories of the past, but from today forward, you will accomplish greater things because you have entrusted your life to me and embraced my will. I love you and envelop you with deep affection. You will never be defeated or overcome. Be filled with courage and affirm your belief in me. Do not linger in worry. Do not be troubled or disheartened about anything. I hear all your prayers. I'm making paths in the wilderness and from my throne flows a mighty river that sweeps away all your troubles, leaving your soul cleansed, calm, and at peace, ready to be filled with faith, hope, and tranquility. Dismiss the thoughts that hammer at your mind. Allow me into those hidden corners where painful memories lurk. I am your Lord, your Savior. I have forgiven your faults. There is no longer any reason for you to torment yourself with doubts and self-reproach. If you truly love and believe in me, Stop believing there is no remedy for your situation. It is not my will for you to spend your days downcast, lacking the faith to look up to the heavens. I want you to be free from all worries, starting today. You are indeed living in a world filled with pain. But remember, 
You were specifically chosen for such a time as this. Born into the right era, every challenge you faced has been part of my divine plan to ignite your faith and humble you, preparing you to receive the wisdom and abundant blessings I am ready to bestow upon you. Your financial struggles will diminish once you release your grip on material possessions. Remember, your family and your health are far more valuable. If you acknowledge my love for you, learn also to love yourself with patience and kindness. Do not strive for perfection. It only lays obstacles in your path and leads you toward confusion. Everyone errs, everyone sins, but I am with you, and I see the pain you endure when you stray from my teachings and succumb to impulsive actions that lead to regret. Yet there is forgiveness and grace waiting for your repentant heart. Each morning presents a new chance, and I'm always here to extend my mercies directly to you. I will come to you, knock on your window, and wake you with a beam of holy, pure light that will illuminate your face and reveal the depth of my love for you. It is time for you to trust in me and cling to my presence. You have a destiny to fulfill, a purpose to achieve, dreams to pursue, and a family to nurture. I ask only for your respect and loyalty. Your heart is already mine, but you must take your journey towards freedom seriously. I did not give you life to see you tossed by every wind that crashes you against the harsh waves. No longer place your trust in fair-weather friends who elevate you only to let you fall at critical moments, then ridicule your misfortunes. They blame you for everything, and you risk believing their lies. Do not fear solitude. Embrace my love and affection. Offer me the innocent faith of a child, and trust in my profound love for you, my vigilant care, and the assurance that you will never be alone. You will find victory in your trials. I will provide all that you need. I will restore your health when you are discouraged, and grant you the strength and perseverance to press forward without faltering. Allow yourself to be loved. Do not fear. Let go of those who leave you and never beg for anyone's presence. I will be your companion on those chilly afternoons when you crave just a word of encouragement, a friendly hand, an understanding ear, someone who listens without judgment. I will meet your needs when you kneel sincerely before me. Do this not merely because I ask it of you, but because you love me. Show me your dedication and fidelity. I do not measure your worth by your outward piety or the perfection of your actions. I am unimpressed by those who flaunt their devotion, yet secretly conspire and slander my chosen and my just. I will honor your loyalty, faith, and dedication, and I will answer your prayers when you come before me with a heart full of sincerity. You already know this, for you have experienced my profound love. You need no further assurances. From today, your fears dissolve. I fortify your beliefs. Worry will no longer haunt you. You will walk with me toward victory, with a heart at peace, embraced by my love and immersed in my tranquility. This is how it has always been, how it is now, and how it will always be. Today, I imbue you with courage. Dispel your fears and strengthen your heart. I do not lead you through trials without a purpose. There awaits a reward beyond the struggles you endure. I am here to transform how you see yourself. You are invaluable to me, and regardless of your past, whether marked by victories or defeats, my love for you intensifies each day. All your experiences have been shaping you for the purpose I have planned for you and your family. Do not dwell on the imperfections of those you love. Today marks a change. They will grow in stature, wisdom, and spiritual maturity. The people you know today will be transformed in the coming months. Remain steadfast in prayer. This phase will pass. 
Your family will rediscover joy. Harmony and peace will return to your home. But today, I ask you to bring me all your concerns, your prayers, and your restless thoughts. Do not be perturbed by trivial matters. Let not anger rob you of the joy you seek. Refrain from uttering hurtful words. Avoid making harsh comparisons. Do not inflict wounds on their souls. While there are rules and commandments to uphold in your home, raise your voice not in anger. Never resort to insults. Before enforcing discipline, calm yourself, take a moment, and ask me to guide your actions and breathe divine wisdom into your spirit. I will help you offer loving guidance to those you cherish. I will be with you from dawn till dusk, and even as you sleep, I will watch over you. I will speak through my word, inspiring dreams of the grand plans I have for you. You will awaken filled with joy and strength, ready to face any challenge with calm and assurance. I will never let you endure more than you can bear. But if you feel overwhelmed, believe in my word. I assure you, you can persevere because the victory is already yours. I have secured it for you. Amen. <laughs>